Skiing is a major draw in Montana, especially during the holidays. We have whitefish, snowball, blacktail, lookout, lost trail, discovery. And at one point or another, there will be a first time skier in need of a lesson. At Bridger Bowl, they're doing their part to make sure every child in the area learns to ski. Patrice Parks has more. Bridger Bowl will see 5,000 kids pass through its Ski PE program. Most school-age kids in the area will get at least one ski day in this season. So in uh, conjunction with our mission statement, making skiing and riding affordable for the local community, and that is definitely our passion of keeping it that way, uh, we have kids from 150 mile radius come to Bridger every weekday uh, during the school year and they get lessons and then they get to go ski and ride with their friends in the afternoon. All receive a reduced rate of $35 for a lesson equipment and a day on the hill. And no student is left out as the ski hill provides help for those in need. The Bridger Bowl Foundation uh, helps out any hardship cases, so if anybody that can't afford to come and um, can't afford that $35, we help them out and the Bridger Bowl Foundation will cover the expenses of that trip for them. This program is done on school days, so for many of these kids, it's a welcome break from the classroom. And, and I like having fun with our friends and being able to go on runs by ourselves. So we get to like, get to know people better and make new friendships. It's just really fun because they have like different levels of like, so like you can just kind of choose and pick. And it's a really cool mountain and like if you go like way up high, the views are really pretty. It's just a blast to get to go out and have fun and teach the responsibility code and get the ski kids out on the mountain enjoying the wintertime. I know many of them that have then started to work in the ski industry because they just got that little taste and they didn't get it with their families, so they get it through school. Reporting from Bridger Bowl, Patrice Parks for MTN News.